a bird in the hand is worth two in the bush. This common phrase means that physical possession of something is better than the potential to obtain something more. But in criminal law, sometimes there's no difference between the bird in the hand and the birds in the bush. Many states' laws define drug possession as actual possession or constructive possession. Actual possession is analogous to the bird in the hand. It means the substance is on the defendant's person. Constructive possession is like the two birds in the bush. It means the defendant knows the substance is present and can exercise control over it, but doesn't physically have it. Smith v. State explores the factors that establish constructive possession in Maryland. Clavin Smith was visiting Yvette Sterling's house when Baltimore police executed a search warrant there. The officers found Smith and four others sitting at a table in a room filled with thick marijuana haze. A smoldering marijuana joint rested in the center of the table, within arm's reach of Smith and the others. And a jacket hanging on the chair next to Smith contained 15 baggies of marijuana in the pocket. The police arrested Smith and the others for marijuana possession. At Smith's trial, he moved for an acquittal, claiming the state failed to prove he knew about the marijuana in the jacket or had control over the joint on the table. The trial court denied Smith's motion, and the jury convicted him. Smith then appealed to the Court of Special Appeals, which affirmed the conviction. Finally, Smith appealed to the Maryland Court of Appeals.